The hub of Saratoga County is the corridor towns that are located along I-87, the Adirondack Northway. The corridor towns are the more populated areas of the county and feature worldwide manufacturers, suppliers, and distribution companies. A large reason for this is the proximity to everything in the county and access to transportation options. We've been in Saratoga County since the beginning. The owners at the time lived in Clifton Park and decided to start the business here, which was a great decision for us overall. It's a great location in terms of working with businesses. There are so many businesses within a 300 mile radius of us between Boston and New York and then even locally. So there's a lot of opportunity there for us to grow and expand. We're not in a major market, so in terms of employees, it gives us a little bit of a break in terms of the cost of living and how when people want to come here. So it's been an attractive location for us because we are able to find good people that are talented and that can do all the different functions that we do. And we've had great success finding those people. It is a great location for us and it gives us many opportunities to help people across the country. The corridor towns are minutes from an international airport and feature transportation options such as freight and passenger trains, major highways, and ports and canals. The Harbor Visitor Center is located in the town of Waterford. Here, the Hudson and Mohawk Rivers meet, as do the Erie and Champlain Canals. The main attraction has long been the city of Saratoga Springs. Horse racing is still the summer place to be, but the city and surrounding areas offer much more. Being here in Saratoga, I mean obviously it's special being in a world-class track with world-class racing and you're in the horse industry, but what it also does because of the amount of race activity and people in the horse industry are here, I'll tell you what, you get the services. Like we have world-class clinic that's five minutes from here. When you're basically raising horses and trying to raise them at, at the highest level, it's great to have those local services. Those would not be here if it wasn't for being in Saratoga. Whether it's the feed guy, outstanding feed, outstanding hay here locally. Being in Saratoga, we can feed off all those services, like, you know, which basically makes us whole Hopefully more successful as well. From horse farms to technology companies, the power of Saratoga County is the exceptional service and collaboration among local businesses. RASP has been around 26 years. We've been in Saratoga County the whole time. Our primary focus is supporting local companies, whether it be service, installation, we do electrical engineering, programming, panel manufacturing and building and we provide all the services surrounding it. So our main goal here is to support all the companies locally and surrounding area for industrial controls and automation and process. I can't say enough about Saratoga County. I would love to see more businesses come in. We're growing, the chip industry is, is heavy in this area. We have a lot of great people. We have a good workforce and our local schools, BOCES, they, they put so much effort into getting more skilled people in this area, more educated people in this area. I give them a lot of credit too. A company that wants to come here, it's, it's a gold mine. I would highly recommend Saratoga County. Families and businesses are eager to relocate to Saratoga County for the benefits and quality of life. But those factors also help retain prospering homegrown businesses. The corridor towns can handle the land needs, technology, broadband, infrastructure, and staffing necessities to help our businesses grow, expand, and prosper right here. Saratoga County has been great. I grew up in Southlands Falls, which was Saratoga County. We've been at three different locations over the 30 plus years from Southlands Falls to Stillwater. In uh, 2014, we moved down here into Waterford property thanks to SCDC and their help to get us down here in Waterford. Developing properties in Saratoga County has been fairly easy, you know, with their, with their team up there. Our first property in 1996 in Stillwater, you know, we were able to develop that property there, put a road in, build our first facility, adding on in 99, 2001, 2004 and then moving down here. So I think developing in Saratoga County is, is a way to go. Yeah, they are business friendly. The corridor towns are unlike other places in New York. Saratoga County continues to be one of the fastest growing counties and the lowest taxed county in New York State. Saratoga County is, is unique. I've actually worked all over New York State 
When I was transferred to Saratoga, I had no clue what I was in for, but Saratoga is probably the best place in New York State to work. The community is thriving, the customers are busy, and it's been great for us. Saratoga Springs gets a lot of the attention, but really when you look at the Saratoga County, there's a lot of thriving communities that surround Saratoga. You know, we all benefit from Saratoga, but Saratoga Springs also benefits from, from these outlying communities as well. A thriving community is made up a lot of different uh, components, but having, you know, good businesses, businesses that are successful, where people have a place to work, attracts younger people, it, it helps our school systems to grow and be better. With a thriving community, along comes all the other stuff that, that wants to be part of that as well. If you've got a good business community, you're going to have all the other components to make a, a great living space. The flourishing business community of the corridor towns of Saratoga County helps make this a desirable place to live, explore, and raise a family.